back with another one. With no further ado, it's the other half to the earlier video. Um, didn't make it all the way through, but hey, you know what I'm saying? Um, we will on this one. I'll let the video speak for itself. Women are wondering why aren't men obsessed and chasing them anymore? Well, like I said in the last video, we have better things to do, but let's listen to them babble. It's kicked in whenever they try to initiate anything with a woman is why they're stepping away. If women are truly serious about finding a man, then I suggest them making the first move, as 86% of women who do so are more likely to be married. I also don't know who dictated it was a man's job to chase a woman, but that's nonsense. Everybody wants to feel needed, no matter how you look at it. So your girl was not able to get her man back. Um, yeah, that ain't even my man no more. Um, but... Yeah, we're gonna have to <laughs> laugh it off. Cause damn, um, and thug it out. Yeah. Guys like having something to chase. No, they do not, especially good men, because they would rather keep their peace than to feel like they're on this constant treadmill of having to prove what they could be or do for that woman. And all the while having to convince her of this with receiving no to minimal effort in return. Exactly. 86% of women who make the move end up marrying that person. That makes a ton of sense. I love when a woman makes the move. By the way, this applies to men too. Of course it does. But we're in a weird time, I think, where like a lot of good guys, I hear it from women. They're like, oh, guys are like, whatever. They don't make moves these days. Right. They're, they're too shy. But it's like from the guy side, like we've grown up like seeing the quote unquote toxic masculinity. We've grown up seeing the guys who are so forward that it's like ridiculous that we never want to be that. So then we actually go too far on the side of the spectrum of like not wanting to bother right. a woman when right. she's out. Do you know what I mean? And um, then That's a bit of pandering. So since he wants to pander to let them know the uh, pillow hands version, I'm gonna go ahead and drop the uh, Tank Davis heavy hitters. Listen, um, Guys on approach, it's not worth the juice, isn't worth the squeeze. We don't care, um, don't want you. Um, you just too much trouble, talk too much, got a roster. Um, you're out there in these streets letting the cat get worked over too much by God knows who. Um, it's, it's just too much going on right now, man. You know, and it ain't nothing to do with whatever he just said. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, these guys and. It's, we did what, we, what you said. You want us to leave you alone? We're leaving you alone. All right. Now all this stuff about we wanted you to leave us alone, but some of you we wanted you to continue to. We don't know which one. We're not doing this. Okay. It's too much crazy. We're not doing it. All right. We're done. You know, if you want um, any type of action, you're going to have to approach us. It is what it is. Just do it. Just approach. Yeah. And from the woman's side, a lot of it is like, well, no, if he wants me, like, guy pursues. So it's like this, okay, then no one's going to do anything. Exactly. <laughs> if a girl makes the move, we know they like us. Gets old, just getting rejected all the time. I think it's more because we don't want to be me too for just saying hi. Nah, it ain't that. This generation just doesn't comprehend what love really is. Today, it's all hookup and dating culture. 16 years ago. It's actually insane how comfy my perfect jeans are. Guys, we've all worn jeans that are tight, uncomfortable, or. Go, the girl I was seeing made the first move. Never dated another woman since. She is the love of my life. I was rejected or friend zoned so much, I completely stopped trying. A lady made the first move, and we've been married seven years. The dating world is different for men and women. When a woman see a man that she wants, she will most likely get that man. Why? Because that's something that rarely happens to him. Unfortunately, the majority of men that makes the moves, they get rejected, and that happens very often. Even on dating apps, 200 swipes on multiple women could equal to one date with a woman. Dating has just become a game of chicken at this point, but truthfully, the women who makes the first attempt has a high success rate compared to the guys. 
but they don't see themselves approaching men because they want that man to do the chasing, pursuing. They want to feel special, filling up their egos. You guys got to stop chasing women, man. It's an imbalance to chase a woman who you are supposed to take care of financially. It's like how? Like, you're supposed to chase a woman, and chase after her while she's dealing with other people, and you're supposed to chase after her to take care of her? Like, you the one that got to come out the pocket, the resources, and provide and protect, and you chasing, why are you chasing after somebody yes. to do that? Like, you supposed to be chasing me, because it ain't that many of me, it's a whole bunch of yous. Even my most type A alpha females tell me that what? they want somebody who's going to pursue them, make the plans, make the reservations, and make the decisions when they get into a relationship. They do this all day, every day for their professions, and they want to come home and be able to put their hands up and say, what are we doing tonight? I'm curious, are you in a relationship? And if so, how'd you get there? We like to be pursued too. Even type A's who do it all day want to come home and ask what we're doing. It's not a... No such thing as an alpha woman. All you have is a bunch of masculine chicks that are out here that are out of control. Jezebel spirit, Lilith spirit, no such thing as an alpha woman. What is she leading? Hell, even the women that's supposed to be part of the secret service, like part of the elite, she was ducking in the back, hiding, watch that video or the picture of that female secret service member, ducking in the back while those bullets were flying. When push comes to shove, these women are going to save their own ass. There's nothing alpha about that. A guy-girl thing. It's a people thing. Why would anyone date an alpha female? First of all, any woman referring to herself like that is confused. Did this for four dates with a woman. She ghosted me. I don't get dating nowadays. This is the largest group of butthurt, bitter pen pals I've ever seen in my entire life. It's